Hey guys, Shinigami here, and today we're playing some Legend of Zelda Skyward Sword. Now, I have a save game from, wow, uh, 2013, so a little while ago. Uh, we're not going to be playing on that save game. We're going to be starting a brand new adventure, and we are not going to be named Link, because why would we do that on my channel? I'm probably just going to be named Shinny, because I don't think oh and I am using actual Wii remote and nunchuck and everything and this feels so weird because I have not actually played on the Wii in a very long time so yeah we're just gonna be named Shinny because uh, there's not really a whole lot of room on the screen or on the the name sorry there's only three more letters I could not have fit my entire name but I have played this one before it's been a really, really long time, obviously. At least almost four years since I last touched it. Um, I did not finish the game. That is a really big, scary-looking thing. Uh, he looks upset. Looks very upset. It took me quite a bit of work to figure out how exactly to get uh, my Wii gameplay on PC. Um, and the good news is it works. Uh, I'm using an Elgato, Elgato HD game capture. The bad news is, in my opinion, the video quality, uh, I'm actually using composite cables. Um, so it's HD is the original we got, uh, but they're still designed for an old CRT monitor or TV. They're not really designed for uh, LCD flat screens. Um, and, wow, those kids just jumped right off of there. They could have all died. But, yeah, so that the... I do apologize for the pixelation and the kind of jagged edges. Unfortunately, unless I was running it straight through uh, to a CRT screen, there's no way to fix that. Um, and I have no way to do that because I don't have any older CRT TVs or a way to record uh, older TVs, so this is as good as it gets for now, unfortunately. But, uh, hopefully in the future, I actually do want to play through some other games as well. Uh, not just Wii games, this is just one that I, I really wanted to go back and play, because I never really got a good chance to finish it. And at times, this actually doesn't look too bad, and I'm hoping that on the recording it looks a little bit better. Man, that thing is... He's huge. So hopefully, again, like I said, hopefully the recording's a little bit better than what I'm seeing. Rise, Shinny. The time has come for you to awaken. You are fated to have a hand in a great destiny, and it will soon find you. The time has come for you to awaken, Shinny. I feel like I said that in kind of a strange way, but I'm okay with that. So this thing is really upset. I don't think it wants me to wake up. Oh my goodness. So I kind of remember this a little bit. But again, it's been years since I played this one. I never got too far in this game. Um, so I'm actually happy that I'm going back now and finally playing it again. I want to try to keep these episodes kind of short in length. Uh, not because I want short episodes, but... Uh, I think it makes for better episodes if I kind of keep them kind of concise. So I'm going to aim for about 10 minutes. Hey sleepyhead, I know how much you like to sleep in, so I'm guessing this letter will be your alarm clock this morning. Did I guess right? Rise and shine, Shinny. Today is the wing ceremony. You promised to meet me before it starts. Remember? You'd better not keep me waiting. Zelda. Ooh. So... Look at that grin. Look at that grin. I'm so happy that Zelda sent me a letter. All right, come on. Can I open? Oh, I can open things. Oh, I found money. A blue rupee, it's worth five rupees. Better drop it in your wallet for now. I actually had no idea I was gonna find money. That's awesome. Can I search anything else? I don't see anything else that I can search. Maybe, maybe this thing? Nope. Okay, we're not gonna search things for now. But yeah, I want to keep these episodes not too terribly long. Oh man, okay, so... 
trying to remember controls here. Gear one and two. Gear. I have like, I have a rupee bag. I have a wallet. That's about it. Let's see. That is to lock on. This is to look. Oh. Okay. That's kind of cool. Uh, what's the plus button? Oh, a map. Okay. That's cool. Um, I honestly have no idea where I'm supposed to go. Am I going outside? That's the restroom. Whoops. Should have paid better attention before I clicked on it. Can I actually go? Oh my god. I'm going to the restroom. Ah, oh, that's fantastic. Wait, I can examine something? What was it that I could examine? Keep it squeaky clean in here. Alright. How do I... Okay, I was like, how do I go back out the door? It wasn't working. Okay, so maybe this looks like a big door. That looks like an exit. I think I found my way out. Uh, I have no idea where I'm going yet, though. But somebody wanted to meet me. Zelda. So we're going to go meet... Zelda somewhere hopefully so this first episode might be a little bit longer because uh, I kind of want to get through like this little I know there's like a little tutorial thing at the very beginning so I at the very least kind of want to try to get through that so bird statue oh hey I can save neat saving in progress that saved pretty quickly Okay, so that's how I save. Oh, I can run. Hey, hey Shinny, up here. Hey, look, there's somebody up there. Yo. Good morning to you, Shinny. Today is finally the day of the long-awaited wing ceremony. Are you feeling ready? Oh, I just remembered. There's something I'd like to ask you about. Look this way while pressing and holding Z. Then press A to have a quick chat with me. All right, I can do that. Let's see, I'm holding Z, and then I can press A to talk. Ooh. Excellent. Always remember, you can press Z to target something. I feel like I just changed his voice. Once you have targeted someone with Z, you can easily talk to him or her by pressing A. And even when there isn't anything to target, pressing Z is a convenient way to quickly face your view forward. Oh, but it's a little silly to carry on a conversation from this distance. Why don't you come join me up here? You should be able to climb up if you dash up to the top of that wooden box, don't you think? Move while holding A to dash. You should be able to make that jump fairly easily. Try climbing up here. Alright. Alright. Let's do it. We're gonna do it. We're gonna run up the box. Yes! Yes! So, what do you think? Using A to dash is useful, isn't it? However, don't dash around so much that you tire yourself out or your stamina gauge will empty and you'll be completely out of breath. It's best to take a little break when your stamina gauge gets close to empty. Got all that? On to the next point. You can jump a short distance like this just by moving toward it. I like to call it the auto jump. Ah yes, auto jump. It just has a nice ring to it. You're like breaking the fourth wall left and right. It's amazing. Hey, I made the jump. So, what are you up to? Rushing to get some last minute bird riding practice in this morning, Shinny? Oh? You have someone to meet? Ah, Zelda's waiting for you, is she? Perfect timing, then. You see, Zelda's father, Headmaster... Gapora? Has a pet named Mia, and well, she's scampered off again. Ah, Mia. Look! Over there, do you see her? The headmaster is so busy working with Zelda preparing for the ceremony, I thought that maybe I should feed her, but the ceremony is about to start, and I just put on a fresh set of clothes, and, well, you see, will you help me out and go retrieve Mia for me? I'm pretty sure that he's just being lazy. Pretty sure. Fantastic. So you'll do it? I know you're in a hurry, so I really appreciate your taking the time to help. I hope I'm giving him, the, like, the same consistent voice. You should be able to climb up somewhere over there. If you hang off that ledge there, you can climb onto the roof from the other side. I'm terribly sorry, but I know you're quite the climber. I really do appreciate it. Alright, so... I'm gonna go across here, alright. Okay, so if I jerk the Wiimote, I can kinda... Oh boy. <laughs> I 
Hey, Shinny! Who's speaking to me? Him? I don't care how good a jumper you think you are, you'll never reach roofs that high. Just pressing A to dash. There should be a wooden box up there. Grab and move one with A and use it as a platform of sorts. You can climb onto a platform by pressing A to dash or by pressing uh, up on the joystick for a few moments. Alright. So I grab the box and move it. Probably need to be like on this side of it. So that way I don't. No, nope, okay, so we're gonna run up here, and yes, we've made it up to the pet. Alright. Is that what you wanted? Yes, nice work, you've brought her back safe and sound. Sorry for troubling you with this. I know you're busy, Shinny. I suppose I should feed Mia now. Please tell the headmaster that we found his pet. He should be up by the statue of the goddess. Alright, I guess I'll head up there. I believe Zelda is there with him, so you should hurry along. Alright, I kind of feel like I should be able to roll, though. Hey, let's go ahead and save while we're here. Sounds like a good idea. Let's save. Just in case I die up here on this this bridge or something. What is this green thing? You got a stamina fruit. This particular fruit replenishes your stamina gauge. Okay. That's awfully helpful. Let's sprint up these stairs. Another stamina fruit. <gasps> Cutscene. Cutscene. I think I get that bluebird eventually, maybe. I don't know. I'm probably making things up. I might be telling the truth, though. Guess we'll have to find out together. Because I'm not sure. Oh! <laughs> wow. Oh, youth. Guided by the servant of the goddess? Can I make this faster? I don't want to press A and, like, skip it. Unite earth and sky, bring light to the land. Hey, good morning, Shinny. I'm glad to see my loft wing got you out of bed. I w was pretty sure you'd sleep in and forget to meet me this morning. I almost did. But look at this instrument, and look at this outfit. They're mine to use today in the ceremony, since I'll be playing the role of the goddess. Aren't they beautiful? Especially this instrument. They tell me it's just like the one the goddess was said to have in the legends. It sounds gorgeous, too. I asked father about it, and he says it's called a harp. <laughs> and look at these clothes. I made this wrap myself, and we get to use it in today's ceremony. Between the harp and this outfit, I'm going to make a great goddess today. I got you up early this morning because I wanted you to be the first to see me like this, Shinny. Awesome, Zelda. Thank you. How do I look? You look great. Because I'm being friendly. Ha! Huh, I think so too, but it's nice to know you agree. Thanks, Shinny. It's weird saying my own ma name like that. Oh, there you are, Zelda. Are you all prepared for today's ceremony? I hope it's an old man. I really hope. Oh, hello, father. Please be an old man. Please be an old man. Oh, Shinny, you're here too. Outstanding. Okay, perfect. It's encouraging to see you up so early, given your capacity for sleep. No doubt today's ceremony had you too excited to close your eyes for once. If you win today's ceremonial race, you'll get to participate in the post-race ritual with Zelda. So give it your best out there. Yes, about that. Father, I don't know if he can do it. Oh, she's... she's doubting me. Already. Recently, Shinny hasn't been practicing much at all for the ceremony. And even when he's out riding his loftwing, he's just lazily gliding around, probably daydreaming. I don't know what he's thinking. He's gonna have to be in perfect control of his bird to win today. She has no faith in me whatsoever. No need to worry yourself, Zelda. Though you may have a point. Today's wing ceremony tests the skill of the rider as well as his bond to his bird. Victory will not come easily. And as you pointed out, I haven't seen him practicing as hard as some of the other students, but you've known him since you were both very little. You should know better than to fret about him. 
You see, Shinny and his loft wing share a special connection. I've never seen anything quite like it. Well, that's good. That's good to hear. I'm glad we share such a special connection. As you know, each of us in Skyloft is but one half of a pair. We are only made whole by our loft wings, the guardian birds that the goddess bespo bleh, 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 bestows upon each of us as a symbol of her divine protection. When we are young, every one of us meets our loft wing under the great statue of the goddess. It's quite a big moment, as I'm sure you recall. Ah, but that first meeting between Shinny and his loft wing was extraordinary. The bird that came to him was a crimson loft wing. Apparently I don't get the blue one. It is a breed so rare we were sure for some time that it had vanished from the line. Yes, and the boy and his bird seemed to share a profound connection from the moment they met. Do you recall when Shinny and that loft wing of his first met? What a sight. The little boy just hopped up on that bird and gracefully flew away without even a moment of instruction. They were meant for each other. And judging by how jealous you were that day, I'd say the friendship he shared with his bird didn't go unnoticed by you, my dear. She was jealous of me and my bird. It's kind of funny when you think about it. Why does he look so disappointed? Oh, uh, but who can blame you? I'm sure you weren't the only one envious of the powerful bond shared by Shinny and his bird. Anyone who is a part of something special is bound to catch some nasty looks sooner or later. Hoo hoo. He kind of reminds me of the owl from uh, Ocarina of Time. This contest is... Oh wait, no, it's Zelda. This contest is nothing to laugh at, Father. This ceremony is part of the final test for those training to become a knight of s become knights of Skyloft. If Shinny doesn't fly fast enough during the race, what if Shinny messes up his big chance? What if he's not allowed to become a knight? Ooh. Calm down, my dear. It will be fine. Honestly, it's almost as though you become a completely different person when you worry about Shinny. She has no faith in me whatsoever. I'm starting it out myself because of her. Hey. Listen, Shinny, you'd better fly your heart out today. At the very least, you need to squeeze in a little practice time before the race. What? Come on, you'll thank me later. Oh, boy. So, if this is the end of the cutscene... <laughs> here we are. Go on now. Jump off the edge and call your loft wing. It's almost time for the ceremony, so try to practice seriously for once. Hmm? Oh, yeah? You can't sense your bird out there? Oh, I get it. You're trying to weasel out of having to practice. Nice try, but you're not fooling me. Is she going to kill me? Off you go. Oh, boy. Okay, Shinny, go ahead. Just press down and call your loft wing. Oh, boy. I feel like I'm going to die. Hmm. His bird sure is taking a long time to get here. I'm going to die. She just pushed me off a cliff. Something's wrong. Or maybe she said that. Something's wrong! It's hard to tell sometimes who's talking. So she's gonna catch me with her blue bird. Hang in there, Shinny! I've got you! After almost killing me, Zelda. Thanks! So I'm pretty sure this is gonna be a good place. Uh, hopefully, to end episode one. We'll see. Are you two alright? Zelda should be fine. I'm sorry, friend. I didn't mean to push you so hard. You didn't sprain your wing, did you? This is very odd, Shinny. What could have possibly happened to your loft wing? For a bird to ignore the call of his master, it's unheard of. And you still can't sense your bird nearby, eh, Shinny? This is quite a problem, especially considering the wing ceremony is about to start. Shinny, when you said you couldn't sense your loft wing, well, I should have believed you. I'm sorry. It's okay, Zelda. I need to tend to my own loft wing, so I'll catch up with you later. You'd better go on ahead and see if you can find where your bird has gone. Oh, uh, come on. Maybe I can save it. Maybe I can save it here. The bells are tolling for me. My, how did it get to be so late? If I recall correctly, this year, Instructor Horwell is presiding over the ceremony. Shinny, you should go explain the situation to him and see if he's willing to delay the race a little so that you can find your bird. 
But father, you're the headmaster of the academy. If Shinny asks Instructor Horwell, he'll probably just come talk to you about it. Ah, oh, quite true. As usual, you make an excellent point, my dear. Very well. I'll explain the situation to him myself, Shinny. Run along and tell Instructor Horwell to come see me in my quarters. Okay. Hopefully this is a good save spot. Uh, so yeah. If you guys have enjoyed this... Uh, I, this is not normally how I promote my channel or anything, but if you guys have enjoyed this, please give the video a like. Um, I'd really appreciate it for one. It help, it does help me out in quite a few ways, uh, but also it, it's kind of a gauge to let me know if you enjoy this type of content or not. Um, I personally love making this kind of content. I love making videos like this and playing games like this. Um, I'm still going to continue live streaming and everything, but I do want to be able to make uh, videos and play different games other than just Dokkan. I'd, I'd like to play more um, and I want to be able to make more videos. Hopefully I can start making daily content for you guys, not just videos and not just live streams, but actual content like all the time uh, so that you guys will have daily things to, to watch, not just every once in a while. So hopefully this can be the start of something new for you guys. Um, I want to do, again, I want to do more than just uh, this game. I want to play other games as well. Um, I want to try to get two or three different games going at the same time that I can record and edit and get ready. Uh, we'll see kind of how that goes. The first few episodes of this will probably be up before I start anything else, though. Uh, we'll see. We'll see. I, I don't know exactly how I'm going to plan this out. I've never quite done anything like this, but I, I do want to try to get uh, daily content up for you guys. So, again... Please like the video if you do enjoy this kind of content, if this kind of video works out. Um, this one is extra long. It looks like I'm about 22 minutes in, unfortunately. Uh, hopefully, the next videos I can actually cut down to. I want to get around 10 to 15 minutes. Like That's my, my window that I want to hit for videos. So hopefully I can do that. We'll see what happens. Uh, but thanks for watching, guys. Shinigaming out.